Made some coins for that God Squad you've always wanted? Check out rockbottomcoins.com for the cheapest and fastest coins anywhere. Use code Zerk for 10% off your order. And if you guys want to compete in tournaments for cash prizes, make sure to check out tourneycrypt.com. The whole thing wobbing. What's going on guys? It's Zerks coming at you today with another YouTube video and today we have got the legend sets finally in the game. So of course beforehand the only way you could actually pull one of these legend cards was through the level 50 max pack. Now just a couple hours before you guys are actually be able to play with the superstar and ultimate superstar edition which by the way it's at midnight for you guys wondering and yes we do get the pre-order packs at midnight but I believe GameStop is apparently calling people saying they can come pick it up at 9. I, I don't really know, but it'll be out of midnight Eastern time. But with these legend sets, of course, we have John Elway, Marcus Allen, Marvin Harrison. Cough, cough. I've actually had a gameplay with all three of these guys up on the channel. Larry Allen, Derek Perotes, Michael Strahan, Mel Blunt, and Ken Houston. Personally, I actually might pick up this Michael Strahan because I got an idea what I'm going to do with my team. And also in the sets, these, of course, are going to be the set cards. So we have an 81, 82, 83, 85, and 87 overall for Michael Strahan. And that's going to be the same overalls for the 89s. The 90 overalls, the overalls you need in their sets, are going to be 88, 86, 84, 83, and 82. So yes, this does mean that we can pull legend pieces and we can also pull full legends from packs now. So we have some packs today. Of course, we have 88 overall John Elway. This actually is kind of a pretty solid card. This is just a set card, of course. Apparently to Baker Mayfield here. The speed is only a 68. Of course, these cards basically just going to have lower stats of the full legend one. But even just some of these set pieces are still going to be very, very good cards. You guys can go ahead and use on your team. I know a lot of people actually plan... After seeing my Marcus Allen gameplay, I got a lot of people saying they want to use Marcus Allen. Well, if you don't want to pay a ton of coins for Marcus Allen, maybe you'll just go in here and get his 87 overall, which still would be kind of expensive, probably like 150k, maybe 200k. But these full legends are going to be like 400k plus. And it looks like the servers are also running, running like a little bit slow. Uh, but we do also have ultimate challenges for these legend players. So let's go ahead and take a look here at the legend player challenges and see exactly what we get i think we're actually going to get probably just the power up for these legend players that's my guess and there's something really cool with power up scores with these legend players so we do have the legend challenges and of course it looks like through here you can get a little bit of coins you get up to 40 coins here in the first week one legends that we have there's eight rewards so going through these challenges what do they give you let's see so i think you probably get yourself a power up so it looks like you get one reward and 3100 coins my guess is that you actually just get the power up player so like mel blunt michael strahan but here's the thing though with these legend players and with the power ups you can power them up up until the slot right before their legend so say you want to get john elway well if you guys happen to have a lot of training i don't know exactly how much it's going to cost you but if you have a lot of training you want to get these players you can get them with training points and level them up up until their full legend. And if you don't have coins picking their full legend, just do the challenges and keep that power up player. Like Melbourne has an 89, you might be able to power up with training up until like 87 overall. And that's still going to be a very, very good corner. So just a little recommendation there. I'm definitely going to be doing Mel Blunt. Uh, I'll probably end up doing Michael Strahan's. And honestly, I might, I might do Larry Allen too. Even though I do have Zach Martin, I'm thinking about doing Larry Allen. Uh, Marcus Allen was amazing for me. Ken Houston sounds like a great safety to have. And just depending on what your team needs, maybe you should mess around, do those. And of course, if you have some trading points, go ahead and do those. Now let's go ahead and check the auction block out though and see if these cards are up, what their price are looking like. And then we're gonna go ahead and open up some packs and try to pull one of these bad boys. I've seen a couple people already pull some uh, legend pieces. So let's see exactly what these full legends are currently going for. I don't think they're gonna be down to like their max low price, I guess you would say, I guess minimum price. Uh, just yet so 89 looks like larry allen is 262k already wow okay that's a little bit cheaper than i thought honestly i think that's a little bit too low you can see here his next one's actually 349 so if i had the coins i'd probably buy this one because 260k for the best right guard in the game seems very very cheap uh michael strahan currently up for 389,000 coins strahan's a beast 86 block shit 89 power move 85 finesse move with 76 speed 83 excel and an 87 strength i'm probably gonna end up picking him up maybe i'll do a set this weekend or something 
And of course, we'll probably have uh, maybe next weekend. I don't think they'll do it this weekend, of course, but probably next weekend, they will end up coming out with, or actually, no, yeah, this upcoming weekend, because then everybody had the game. This upcoming weekend, we should have the next batch of Legends, and that one, of course, include Legend Fantasy Patch to make these guys quite a bit cheaper, especially on the weekends. We also have Marvin Harrison, which I've already done gameplay with. You guys can see his stats, 89 speed, very good route runner. He definitely showcased that. Uh, catch and traffic, spec catch. That, that catch and traffic definitely showed in the gameplay too. Marcus Allen was a monster. Actually just uploaded gameplay with him this morning. Make sure you guys check it out. He's got 87 speed, 86 acceleration. I really want to see his stats on his uh, 87 overall card. I think it might be really good. We also have Mel Blunt here, which you want to compare him to Jalen Ramsey. Yeah, beats him in speed, excel, jumping, agility, play rec. But Ramsey actually beats him in three things. I want to see tackling, so that does go to Mel Blunt. Block shed also goes to Mel Blunt, okay. And hit power spread to Mel Blunt, yeah, 77. So I'm definitely going to try and pick up that Mel Blunt because he's going to be amazing. And then we also have Ken Houston with 88 speed and 86 acceleration. I currently have Jamal Adams as starting strong safety, but... I might end up getting the power of Ken Houston, just powering him up for now, until I actually pick up that full legend. And then the 90 overall legends are currently going for about 336, and John Elway's 450. I actually sold my Elway for 440k, so I think that might not have been a bad idea. So those are the legends that we have. Let's go ahead and open up some packs. Do we have regular packs in the store yet? I don't think so. So currently, the only packs you can actually buy in the store right now, and I just realized this like a couple days ago, actually are with points or you have elite player packs, you can do with coins and then get a gold. So that's literally it. So we're going to go ahead and open up some get a gold player packs. Let's see if we can actually get a legend pool. I'm also going to be opening up, if we get a launch bundle today, then I'll open up the launch bundle today. If we get a launch bundle tomorrow, or not tomorrow, when you guys actually get the standard edition, so on the second, I will be opening up the launch bundle then, whichever day, you guys already know. I'm going to rip that bundle open, so make sure you guys hit that like button. And, of course, turn that subscribe button on. Turn the subscribe button. Turn the notification bell on. Why do I say subscribe? Turn the notification bell on so you guys don't miss a single upload. As we have 75 overall, Keelan Cole there. Next, get a gold. And, unfortunately, nothing good there. We're going to probably end up doing quite a few of these get a golds. I have 137,000 coins. I'll probably do maybe 10 more after this get a gold bundle here and see if we can get something glitchy. We get ourselves a 78 Marcus Cannon. Okay. Let me get a legend. I know the legend animation. When you guys see it, you'll know it. 77 JJ Arcega Whiteside. That's not the legend animation as well. That's a 76 overall Alex Smith. I don't even know if he's going to be playing this year or not. Next, get a gold. It's not going to be any. I, I need like an, at least an elite. Can I get an elite at least? If not a legend player. Dang, man. So 10 get a gold and we get nothing but a bunch of, well gold <laughs> buy more get a gold player packs and if i don't get a legend pull or an elite player out of these packs i'm definitely not gonna be opening up any more well i'll do i'll do five more packs at like this we don't get anything out of the next five then these packs are just not good right now we get a 73 overall josh reynolds come on man give me some glitchy yay. let me get a legend pull that is not a legend pull we get a 74 jonah williams okay legend no that's a gold that's gonna be a 78 andy dalton and Elite, okay, can we get some good? 81 Big Ben, that's probably like 10,000 coins. Final five, get a gold player packs. Let's see if we can clutch this out, please. Oh, we're starting off with an Elite, okay. 81 Marvin Jones, what's he actually looking like? 81 speed, eh, 83 spec catch, not too bad there. He's probably like 12,000 coins. I'm really hoping they end up adding in as we get a power up player, Patrick Peterson. I was kind of hoping we get the Legends. Ooh, and actually I can show you guys that. I'll go on the auction and I can show you the Legends player power-up. And if there's one for a decent price, I honestly might just buy it. Because I don't feel like playing the challenges if they're full games. I didn't even look to see if they are full games. But I'll probably end up doing some of the challenges. I'll, I might just buy one of these power players to show you guys exactly what they look like as we get a 72 Mike Remmers. So I believe they actually are full game solos. And you can see here, Mel Blunt's power up is only 5,800 coins and actually cheaper. I'm going to fresh one more time. If there's another cheap one up, I'll probably just buy that one. But that's actually pretty cheap for a power. I'm going to buy this for 5,100 coins to show you guys this. So you can go ahead and power these guys up with training points. You guys see I literally have one training point, so I'm not going to be able to power them up. But you can power them up. Let's see, how far up can you actually take Mel Blunt before you need his card? Tier 6. So you can give Mel Blunt up to an 87 overall card with just training points until you need to add his 89 overall cards. So this is kind of a way to get 
I not really budget because right now, obviously, training points are super, super expensive. But when training actually comes down, it's going to be a lot, lot better. Mel Blunt here has 84 speed, 85 excel. Uh, he's also got 83 zone, 52 block shit. Still really good block shit, 74 hit power. I'm probably going to end up getting this card, 84 speed with 85 acceleration. I'm going to get as much training points as I possibly can and probably power up this Mel Blunt. Because honestly, 84 speed, I mean, that's better than Patrick Peterson, Byron Jones, Stephon Gilmore. Matching him with Jalen Ramsey would be amazing. But with that being said, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. And if you did, smack the like button, subscribe, and comment. If you guys happen to get yourself a Legend Pole or a Legend Peace Pole, comment down below what you guys happen to get. And of course, later tonight, the full game does release. We get the pre-order packs. I'll be dropping a video on that. And we also get the loyalty tokens as well. So be on the lookout for that video. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time.